So a very warm welcome back everybody to the Olympic Tennis School here in Tashkent, Uzbekistan. The second semi-final is already on court. The first one didn't even last an hour between the young 17-year-old Anastasia Potapova and Katerina Kozlova. And it was Potapova who booked her spot in tomorrow's final to see who her opponent is going to be. It will either be Margarita Gasparian on the right-hand side of your screen or Mona Bartel. Yeah, it's nicely done. Both players started well behind their own serve. So clever from Bartel. She played a really, really good defensive lob. 40, 30. That's nice. A nice combo, the serve out wide, followed by the big cross court backhand. That's very nice. Good move forward. Executed the volley nicely and well for the first time really now on the Bartel serve. It's just being put under just a little bit of scrutiny. Well, she gets over the line just about Mona Bartel and she's now just one game away from taking this opening set. 5-4 she leads. <laughs> it's long. And there is the opening set. And it goes the way of Mona Bartel. Both players look so assured behind their serve throughout that first set. But right at the end, Gasparian blinked and Bartel took her opportunity. 35 minutes. The German takes it by six games to four. Can't make the pass, Game Gasparian breaks. Perfect response from the Russian after losing the first set 6-4. She has Game an immediate six. break to start off the second. Yeah. That's good. One way traffic Onish. at the moment. Slightly heavy handed with that volley. Woo! 
Yeah, nice combo. Good serve out wide. This is an important service game for Gasparian. Ah, it's really well done. Game, and it is a good hold, so she at least stays in touch in this second set. Yes, She's not just going to hand it to coach. Margarita Gasparian. But it is the Russian in control. 4-1 she leads. And a decider is exactly where we're going. Bartel nets again. It was a set littered with errors from the German. And Margarita Gasparian, after losing the first 6 4, has taken the second 6 1. What will happen in the third? It's a very good hold. A very important hold for Mona Bartel. She managed to save a couple of break points along the way and levels it up at one game all. And that's exactly what it is. Big fist pump from the Russian. And Gasparian now edges in front in this final set. 2-1 she leads. to Gasparian. After losing the first set, she's in control now. She leads by three games to one. So a chance to get back on serve. <laughs> Which she does. And just like that, Gasparian's advantage has disappeared. Four games to three. All of a sudden, Bartel could be serving for the match. And that is exactly what is going to happen. What a huge moment in this match from 40 Lover. Gasparian loses five consecutive points. And in a couple of moments' time, it will be the German Mona Bartel serving for a place in the final. Made it, breaks back. You've got to really hand it to Margarita Gasparian because her mind must have been racing after what happened in the previous game, getting broken from 40 love up.
Oh, well done. Magnificently done from Gasparian. Manages to save both break points. Well, she's going to have a look at one match point. And just over three years later, after three knee surgeries, the Russian is back in another final. Gets the better of Mona Bartel in three. Four, six, six, one, seven, five. In just a minute shy of two hours, it will be two Russians that will contest this year's Tashkent Open final tomorrow as Margarita Gasparian will take on.